Happy liminal space, miss everybody. It's that time right in the middle between Christmas and New Year's where you feel like doing nothing and you're super lazy. And that's been me basically for the past few days. I just woke up from a nap, which was very nice, but also I'm still kind of like half groggy and everything from the nap. So <laughs> don't worry, I'll get, I'll snap out of it. We'll be, we'll be back on the road. We're going to go get the, get the cash. We're going to get some, some of this stuff, head up to Dr. Nakamoto's lab. And then we're also going to activate the, the monolith so we can get into the vault and detoxify the planet. We're going to pull out its toxins, like some kind of, you know, like your friend who went to massage school and she loves essential oils and you know, she's really into toxins that, you know, don't exist or whatever. Don't tell her that though. She won't like to hear it. <laughs> God, all that woo woo nonsense always bothers me. <laughs> Right, it's the oh yeah it's right there I, I think I did see this earlier and I just didn't actually get it oh and also while we're here we can get this perfect the mining zone has been depleted so where exactly is oh it's up okay I thought it would be like right down there let's go it's gonna be up like on the top Maybe we could just jump our way. Oh, come on. Ryder. Ryder, you you got that athleticism, right? Come on, you can do it. Can I jump up on top? Is there a little... Oh, shit. Oh, come on. There we go. Now let's get up to the top. Oh, we're doing it. Oh, this is not, it's too high. <laughs> it's like right below me. Shit. Oh, we're fine. <laughs> I thought for sure that would actually damage me. Where is it? Isn't it on my... Oh, maybe I had that one activated. Oh, here, okay. So it's up, but not too up. But also more up? Drac, please. Don't hurt yourself. Maybe it's just inside? It's the data pad. Oh, it's right here. Okay, now we're good. Let's go get the next, um, thing. The next, uh, uh mining thing. <laughs> like I said, I'm still waking up from my nap. Brain not work. I have a bad case of brain not work. Oh, did we get both of them? Wow. Also, I think this just opened up. I did not notice that before. It's up there. Although there is a road right over here. Maybe I should actually take the road. Rather than just trying to go up a, a sheer cliff like I often do. No, oh, is it? Here they come! Ah, jeez. I just want to go and get the thing. Why are you guys being such bitches about it? <laughs> oh, they noticed. Yeah, they've noticed. Let's call up old friend. No, not that. No. That. That. Six buttons on this mouse, and I put those two right next to each other, and I always pick them up. Oh, you're doing it, Zap. Also, Grandpa's getting it, too. Hey, stop it. Stop it. Let's get a nice view. <laughs> too nice of a view, I guess. Ah, come on. Oh. 
Yes! You got this one? He's got it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Now, do they have one of those uh, things? The I guess the remains. Those are not the things I'm looking for. But what is this multi-purpose generator? Turn it off. You guys don't deserve electricity. I thought there would be one of the um, triangulation points. What if they're? What if they actually are? You know. You know what I'm talking about. You guys know what I'm talking about. Is that one? Or is that just a box? That's just a box. Not even a box of interest. That is a box of disinterest. You're a grumbly boy. Not having that. Oh, I guess the road actually was down there. I was like, did I miss the turn? I did not. I just didn't go far enough. That's, it's all right. I took a little, uh, <laughs> little detour. Oh, had a little bit of a weird stutter there. Did you see that? Let's check out this house. Knock, knock. Anyone home? Is the lady of the house in? Avon calling. Extrapolation on the matter is ongoing. Um. Who put this data pad here? It's not mine. Why do things keep appearing like this? What is. Genocide is the intentional destruction of a given population. Alright, these people are For weird. Examination will be necessary. Are you guys like androids trying to pretend that you're real and sneak into the population or something? You're like the kids care about genocide. It wasn't here yesterday. Greetings. The day Error. Keep that interaction is not understood. Oh. Report logged. Oh, they are absolutely androids. Why are you all talking like that? Counterforce targeting is a strategic approach to destroying the enemy's command structure and military forces. Deeper extrapolation on the matter is ongoing. Counterforce targeting is a strategic approach to destroying the enemy's command structure. It's really excited about counterforce targeting. Okay, these people have something wrong with them. Can you help? What's happening here? Who are you? Is this your data pad? Are you one of them? Are they androids? They come on, they are androids, right? Somebody's programmed these people to pretend to be humans. Who are you afraid of? Who is them? Whoever's behind all this. Everyone's acting crazy, spouting all that nonsense. I can't remember how it started. I'm not even sure how I got here. What do you mean? Nobody's in their right mind. And there are these people, others. They showed up and they left this data pad. Probably uh, don't read the data pad. I have a feeling it may have something to do with whatever's going on. What did these people want? If I knew, I wouldn't be asking you. I heard one of them say, we left the data pad behind. I'm, I'm fine now. I'm sorry to trouble you. It was nothing. Oh, they've got him. Seeing you. Oh, they got him. Sam and the data pad. Probably a bad idea, but we're doing it. The Krogan and Asari show no signs of neural disruption. Their patterns remained entrained. The Solarian shows signs of some resistance with occasional breaks in pattern. We'll likely need to adjust for Solarian physiology. To be on the safe side, entry code has rotated to 9XA2. Entry code. Oh, they're all robots. Greetings. Oh, that interaction is not understood. Uh oh. Oh, I was gonna try to use the 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 code that I just got on him. He exhibits relatively normal brain activity, though there are signs of highly elevated stress. What can we do for them? Nothing immediate, though if you scan others, I may be able to locate the source of the signal. Highly unusual synaptic activity in brain, external high frequency detected. 
contains large data packets. An unknown signal is targeting the brain and interfering with mental activity. They exhibit unusual brain activity. An outside signal is affecting their thought process. Further scans are required. Ma'am? <laughs> She's very excited, though. This person shows signs of the same outside interference. I have now traced the source of the signal, marking the nav point on your map. Which way is it? It's just like around here? Oh, yeah, it's in the vicinity, but it is a little bit farther down. Wasn't there another building just right down the way? Come on, we're getting in the car. We're gonna help these people. Okay, so they're not robots. <laughs> I was really into that robot theory. But there are probably robots or like a big AI or something. Oh, it could be AI, yeah. Maybe there's an AI trying to control them and pretend that it's people. It's like just a random garbage can over there. There's no garbage collection out here. This is the Badlands. Why is there a garbage can? That's the most suspicious thing of all. They're not even throwing out gross stuff. They're throwing out good things. Knock, knock. The Pathfinder's here. Take me to your leader or whatever. You're not supposed to be in here? You're not supposed to be, like, taking over people's brain functions. Would you actually talk? There it went. What the hell are you doing to those people out there? It's an experiment. Physically, no harm has come to them. They're fine. They are under some stress, I could tell. What sort of people are you? Unappreciated geniuses. We used to work for an organization oh, called no. Cerberus. Until our boss decided he'd rather spend money on truly crazy ideas like bringing back people from the dead. <laughs> crazy, it'll never work. <laughs> Project Lazarus. Pure voodoo. But in Andromeda, we're our own masters. And what you saw out there, it's the birth of something amazing. A biological network. A host of minds all linked together. Connected. We're harnessing the power of consciousness to create a new kind of supercomputer. You know, maybe you should do your experiments on each other rather than just random people who are not even aware of what's going on. You know, haven't you heard of, like, ethics boards or anything? Come on. What is Cerberus about? Yeah, what is Cerberus Purity. about? We think humanity should chart its own course, free of alien laws or the morality designed to hold us back. Our boss was straying from the path, lost his focus. He and that Lawson woman were recruiting all the wrong people. Friends in low places. Andromeda is a chance for a do-over. Humanity should call the shots here. The rest can follow our lead. God, I thought I left Cerberus behind. What exactly is this experiment doing to those people out there? The right energy focused at the right frequency can entrain a person's consciousness. The mind is ultimately just electromagnetic patterns. You mean mind control? Those people were banished. They're criminals. They were using their minds to make trouble anyway. We thought we'd make better use. And now, by linking them together, they're like a living computer. But working at the speed of thought. Similar to the computer you've got in your head. God, but I... Ugh, I allow it to be there. <laughs> what are you doing on Kadara? The Badlands is a perfect place to do the work that needs to be done. Must be done. Against all these new threats in Andromeda, it's vital we find an edge for humanity. Yeah, I've heard enough. All right, everybody get your guns out. <laughs> enough of this. Sam? I've located the control for the signal. It will shut the experiment down. We can't stop you, but those people depend on the signal now. Their minds need it to function. Leave them be. I think you're lying. And even still, they're not in control of themselves. What, are you going to leave them as prisoners in their own bodies doing things they don't want to do? You got anything else to say before I go? What? No. I've heard enough. Is there anything else before we go? Can I? Yeah, I can scan it at least. 
Machine converts computer data into electromagnetic patterns for broadcast. Oh, we're shutting it down. How do we shut this experiment down, Sam? I can tune the signal against the scientists as punishment, freeing the people. The victims will likely suffer complications as a result. Or I can alter the nature of the signal to ease the victim's predicament, unlock the system from further changes. Or I could just walk away and do nothing. So wait, I can I can turn it on the scientists. And it said the victims will have some complications, meaning the three people over there. But then it'll hurt the scientists and they won't be able to do something like this again. Or I can ease their situation, not necessarily free them, but ease it, leaving the scientists unharmed. So they, but they also can't continue to use this for anything, though they could just build it back up. Uh, I mean, probably ease their situation. I would really like to hurt the scientists, but in the process, I don't want to have to hurt the people who just did nothing to deserve it. All right, we'll ease it. Change the signal. Try to make things easier on those people. You ruined it. Those people are no good to us now. Glad I could help. Now go back and crawl under the rock you came from. We just shoot them dead. <laughs> I was like, what is that out there? It's just this guy. Well, let's check on those people. They're not too bad off. I really did consider uh, turning it on the scientists, but just the fact that it would hurt the the innocents in the process. Being a prisoner in your own mind, that just sounds horrific. The music, do you hear it? It's so beautiful. The song, the singing. It's so pretty. Oh no. Light, the sky, life is good. <laughs> I don't know if this is any better. Oh no, I don't know if I made the right choice. Such a nice feeling. I mean, sure, they feel great. But they're also not going to be able to fend for themselves. They're, they're just dead. Yeah, that is not a good outcome either. I thought it meant it would just like ease their suffering, like they'd have half control of their brains or something. Oof. That was... Uh, but then if I had also turned it on the scientists, it would have hurt them in the process. They probably just would have been sitting there in pain the whole time. God, no good choice here. Let's head up to the lab. Also, I wonder if there's something out here or if it's just going to be a walled off area. I feel like there's a sneeze coming on, but it's not quite coming on. So if I start sounding stuffy, that's what it is. This technology is unaffiliated with Kadara's factions Pathfinder. It's owned as a likely criminal class. <laughs> no. Criminals? Around here? We can park it here. And... Oh, that truck. That's it. Yeah. Just gotta get the one in the back since it had higher health. Hey! Fuck you, guy! Can I get a better view? This one more over there. <laughs> Metro, that's not how. Hmm. Oh, this is just the place I was at earlier, isn't it? All right, we're out. 
We're out of here. So is this where that spot on the map is? Yeah, that... We're not going to be able to go through there. I'm curious, but it's not going to let us. There's going to be a wall right up here. Yup. Oh, I hear you gurgling back there. No! I don't want to get out of here. This lab is up a little bit. That looks like it right there. Nakamoto's lab. This is gonna be fun. Nakamoto. <laughs> nice work. Did I kill that one dead in the first hit? And not bad. Oh, that's a lot more. Oh, jeez. God, how much health did he have? Alright, let's pull up. <laughs> God, I wanted to run one of them over. Wants to join the fun. What? Ah. Okay, we're see. That's one way off over there. <laughs> Get him! Get him! <laughs> I love the squad. All right. Where are these guys? Are they inside? And eh, not all of them. We got around here. This thing. Oh, some refills. A treasure trash can. Can I use any of this? Meh. Okay. Into the lab. Oh. I guess this is because if you don't kill all of them, you're in a sitting a sitting duck as you're standing here. Taking forever to open the door. Don't hurt me. I'm not gonna hurt you. I just want the the thing. The formula. Please, don't shoot. I'm unarmed. Relax. I'm not here to hurt you, Dr. Ferenth. Dr. Arena Ferenth. I only want the Oblivion formula. Then I'll be on my way. Ryota sent you, didn't he? With a sob story about Sloane misusing his medical breakthrough. Something like that. Oblivion wasn't his breakthrough, it was ours. You gotta be kidding me. Is everyone on this planet a lying asshole? We always meant Oblivion to be a highly addictive drug. That it has medicinal value was a coincidence. Then why did Dr. Nakamoto quit the outcasts? <laughs> Ryota didn't quit. He was fired. Pushed Sloane for a bigger cut. You've had, what, one conversation with him? I've known Ryota for years. Everything he does, he does for credits. But you're different. I play survival above credits. Give Ryota the formula, 
and I'm as good as dead. Sloan will see to that. How do I know that you're not lying? I've seen Sloan's outfit. Not a lot of doctors. You're too valuable to kill. She'll see it as cooperating with the enemy. Loyalty's more important to Sloan than brains. I don't know. I'm not buying it. Didn't we read Ryota's journals and then he seemed... I don't know. I don't remember anything even making me suspect that he would not... Mm, I'm really not buying it. You're lying about Dr. Nakamoto to keep the formula. You willing to bet my life on that? Yep. Fuck you. <laughs> it's good that I did sneak around and find his journal, because I, I don't remember what it said from right now, but I am pretty sure that he, in his own journal, he wrote things that would corroborate his story. And then I have nothing to go on from her except her word. Dosage. Arena, slums need another re-up. Also adjust the dosage. We had two more die on us. It's bad for business. We want them addicted, not dead. Kaitis, lab monkeys should have another batch ready for you pronto. As for the dosage, might be dangerous to adjust without Ryota. I suggest keeping it as it is. Oh, so she didn't even know how to use it. What with all your medical experience? Just do as I say. Alright, I'm going to raid your lab then. She got anything else to say before we go? No, she won't even talk to us at this point. Okay, I'll hit that, and then we'll go back. So let's... Let's hit up the last uh, last monolith. Where's the car? Did we park? Oh yeah, I drove it way over there, trying to run people over. Is this one gonna have another weird entrance? Excuse you. Oh look, there's like stairs practically. It's a fancy little monolith. Alright. Get to scanning. L1 right there. Perfect. Oh, I can't jump when I'm in this. Two more. Oh, this one way up top there. Okay, we'll possibly do that in just a moment. Let's see where this one goes. On the other side. I think that's it right there. Yeah. Oh, it's tough. And then I think it was up on top of this arm thing. See, what's the best way to actually get up there? Oh, I could jump over from the rock. Yeah, there we go. I detect no additional glyphs in the area. Right, let's activate. <sighs> oh god, now the one time I'm not expecting it to be like this. Okay, let me let me play the game. I think that's it. Let me do a quick double check. None of those are the same, none of those are the same, none of those, none of those, and the I don't think... I don't think there are any errors. Alright, let's just... let's do it. Submit. 
Interface successful, Pathfinder. Okay, let's get to the vault and fix Kadara's water. Where is the vault? Oh, it's up there. Okay, I guess it's good that I didn't go that way because the vault is over there. But we're going to go back and see the good doctor before we do anything else. Actually, I guess I could just teleport down there. Dr. Nakamoto. Doc Nak. I'm sure nobody calls him that. And we also have a few other things to turn in, I'm pretty sure. Who's up in the back? That was how I went up to his place. So maybe it was around... Yeah, around back this way. He was in one of these shipping containers. I know it hurts, but... My skin burns! I do want to check his place. Because I want to reread his journal and see if I was really... Oh, that was the black market. Here it is. Uh, no credits, little supplies, people down here need me. Oblivion down around the corner. Someone had mysteriously given him money. Yeah, he... I'm sure that he's trustworthy. Unless he planted that there himself and was very, very good at covering his tracks. Doctor? Doctor? I know you're busy, but doctor? Doctor! Please, doctor! Oh my god, he's not talking to me at all. Do I need to get, like, over here? There. <laughs> Good news, doctor. Got your formula. You have no idea what this means to me. Oh shit, I just One accidentally clicked. One of your old clicked. co-workers, Dr. Ferenth, claimed she helped you create Oblivion. That it was always meant to be a drug. That's a lie! Arena's not even a doctor! Figured as much. You've only shown yourself to be a decent man. Thank you, Pathfinder. I won't forget this. Have anything else to say now that we've helped Pathfinder. you? Pathfinder. Oh. <laughs> I'll let you get back to work. Thanks. Lots to do. We've got a couple things over here, probably inside the bar. There's a new quest and something to turn in, it looks like. Welcome back. Get you a drink? <laughs> Again, it gets really loud when I talk to them. Yeah, drink sounds good. Sure. I'll have whatever you made me last time. One Kadara sunrise. Coming up. Just down the whole thing right there. Doesn't even enjoy it. Oh, I I thought I thought that he was the one with the quest. Nope, it's up. All right, I do need to turn the thing to this guy, Derek. Found your surveyor. He broke his neck getting barite samples. Good surveyors are hard to find. Hope you retrieve the samples. Here you go. Wonderful. Here are your credits. You earned them. Two hundred seventy experience. How many credits? Maybe I missed it. Reyes in his private room. Reyes. Ryder. Perfect timing. You saved me the trouble of looking for you. And maybe I want to be in trouble. Or be trouble. Okay. Should I go? You look like the type who enjoys the chase. Huh. <laughs> Looks can be deceiving. I'm too shy for that nonsense. <laughs> oh yeah, a real introvert. So what did you need me for? A business rival. Zia Cordier lifted cargo I was moving for a client. You want my help getting it back? 
We worked so well together on the row car job, I thought you'd be willing. What is the cargo? What did she steal? No idea. Client paid extra for privacy. Considering my fees, it must be valuable. You didn't check? Honor's got a price. And the client paid it. How was it stolen? How'd this rival of yours get hold of your cargo? Her usual tactics. Got my middleman drunk and stole his ship. Sounds like you know from experience. Please, I keep to a three drink maximum when I'm on a job. <laughs> I'll help for a price. We cut the profits 50 50. 60 <laughs> 40. Final offer. Deal. When she stops in Kadara, Zia drinks at Krala's song. We'll start there. See if Umi heard anything that could help us. Oh, we're gonna have to go up for that, right? But we're gonna go out to, uh, to the vault. Detoxify this place. I don't think there's anything else in the slums. No. All right. Let's get it back out and head to that vault. Can I just jump the fence? Oh, so much easier. Okay. <laughs> Can I port over? Well, there's one right there, but nothing particularly close. Oh, there's more minerals up there. Ooh. No, I'll probably come down and just go over. Uh, I guess let's get in the car and go. I should have activated waypoint, or is it activated? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, good. Again, really kicking up the mud. Oh, and I feel that steam's coming on again. But it's not happening. Oh, I hate that so much. <laughs> oh, there it went. Finally. Watch it! Shouldn't stand in the road, what are you doing? There's the wind farm. So I think we're like halfway. I see the I monolith lights. I'm surprised that the tires don't get all like nastied up by the, the water, but I guess it's toxic, it's not like acidic. What are you guys doing? Oh. It's alright, I'll just, I'll pass. Light just goes to nothing. Oh, there it comes. We got targets. <laughs> we had had targets. All right, friends, we're here. We are gonna fancy this place right up. Gonna gentrify the neighborhood. Very dark. Oh, good. Someone turned the lights on. Is this gonna be another short vault? Really, they've all been fairly short since that first one, which was very long. <laughs> Goodbye, friends! Oh, we're getting zaps. Okay, Remnant Vault. Let's get this place up and running. No more electrical current. I thought that the current would be the problem we'd have to deal with here. Although, what? 
Those little... Those little things are nothing? Hmm. That is not active? What are these gonna be? <laughs> what is gonna be the shtick here? Alright, wake up, Vault. Well, we turn the power on. You'll need to locate the console to activate the purification field, Pathfinder. I'm safe out here. Am I gonna hurt in there? Several interface connections converge here. Oh. I will highlight the ones you need. Yep, alright. So we have to go in and then I can't reach it from out here. Okay. Do this one. At least my shield seems to do pretty well. Though this, I'm sure there are going to be ones that I have to go through, like a larger field or a stronger field or something. This is just the training round. Okay, we should be able to get to the purification console. Oh, I see some friends. This little robot butt. Oh, they look like little bats. Enemies! Between the eyes. I don't know if they have eyes. What's that? Oh, it's just the light from that. Okay. Is there something else down there? Oh, that's a long way down. Okay. okay. We've got the hexagonal platforms. Is that a console? No, that's uh, a uh, that's cover. Guess we're hopping. Ah. I gotta admit, this is kind of exciting. This seems like it's gonna rise up or something. Oh, I hear you guys. Thank you. That can that be climbed up? But I want to climb up. Okay, there's a ceiling too low. Before I activate that, maybe I should. Nah, I'll just turn it on. I thought maybe I should go investigate first, but we'll see what it does. This may affect your escape from the purification field. I see. Let's go up first. Whenever one of those happens, it seems like that's opening the way for the, like, the extras. these weird bridges. It's gonna be Remtech. a fight here. Bet we can grab it on the way back. I see, okay. I will add this map to your interface, Pathfinder. Thank you. Pathfinder, the way across is console activated. Yeah, 
I think so. Let's get, let's get a little ammo while we're up here. So I assume that... We might be going over there. That might be a big giant door that we need to open. That console. What does that do? So there is a way around... around there. Also, that... the console up at the front... Did that just open a way straight across? I'm gonna go back and take one more look at that before we go. Looks like it just opens. Ah, uh, shit! It opens the way just straight, straight to it. Although it is, it is some very long jumps. At least the water is shallow. So yeah, it looks like in order to get through, we'll have to go around this way if we want to get whatever that REM tech is in there. Oh, there's a lot more to this place. Is that in... Front or behind? Alright. I thought I was far away. I thought I'd be far away enough that they wouldn't notice me. That one? I think that one's behind something. Or is that a turret? It's gonna activate as I get close. Oh, I see. We could have come over here and activated it, and it would turn. We could have turned it against all the remnant that was here. You doing all right back there? This isn't the purification field, is it? This could get ugly. <sighs> I was beginning to wonder if it would actually notice me. Fuck you, buddy! Oh, those are destructible. Oh, shit. Oh, I need some cover. I know we got the big one right there, but I just don't want to also have to deal with all the little boys around. Oh, he 
Ryan's doing a big one. Now, I know that there's that console right there. But is that... Oh, shit. It's a turret. This is going to be the purification console. Does this need to give me a shield? console on the floor there. Is this the the end wait wait before I continue. What am I missing? This that point of interest. Okay, so it is all the way out across there. Good. So now I don't feel bad about and wait I didn't have any any of the glyphs did I or maybe I do but oh there's only four to start with oh this one's gonna be difficult you know what I have eight of these why don't I just override had enough of you that did the job. Good go. Thanks. I worked real hard on it. But what did that do for me? <gasps> Is there still another console on the floor? Oh well. Maybe later on it'll be for something. Mains. Yeah, that just controls that. Okay. door, another room like that up here. Is there one across back that way? Like, are there three of them? Ah, there's some friends in here. Sure was another one for a second. Looks like there's a trick to this interface. Let's figure it out. Okay, so there's one of those glyphs, one of those, and one of those. Oh, there's a lot of glyphs. Okay, so we got the one that looks like an A first off. So we should probably turn that one on first. One that looks like 
Kind of like an O, I guess. A weird O. And then, uh... I've got V with a top and a little dot on the side. <laughs> Not one of those. This one. The one that looks like a Japanese sheet. Is that it? Yeah, there it is. And there's the E with an extra bit in the middle. Is that. There it is. Like a C with two dots, maybe. And then last is the one that is left. <laughs> the whatever this is. Nice. What do we get? We got spinny things. A high concentration of data here, Pathfinder. I recommend scanning. Bunch of rare devices. Oh, and a data core. Kiki will be glad to know you have found another of these devices. We have conquered your puzzle. On to the next. Well, you know, this is a larger vault than I was anticipating. I really thought we were just going to be in and out again. Was there a room across the way? Does not look like it. Oh, this container though. It's some junk. Actually, is there Is that anything right there? No, it's just a little spot on the wall. Is there a way to get across to that? That looks like a door. It is a door. Is there a console that I haven't seen? Like maybe up on top of some of that stuff? no way we're going to get around like that rock and stuff. I don't think there's anything else back in this corner. Okay, that's just part of the wall. I don't believe there's anything up there either. Does this affect anything else or is it only the... I see, okay. So it's either cover or those like uh, shield areas. Okay, so now what I'm thinking probably we'll have to do is hit that switch to turn the bridge back on so we can get across here. On the way out, we'll have to run across hit the switch, and then run back up here and go get the thing. So I'll have to do a little backtrack. Oh shit. <laughs> I thought I was going to fall straight into the water. God. Ah, why? Why? Such a long jump. It's like somebody's already been here and killed them. Ha ha ha.
All right, at least that clears up how to get over here. Ah! But... Door is still red. Is there a console? Nothing like hidden around here, is there? Uh, what? Oh jeez. Oh, God, how how in the world? <laughs> Was there a hidden console up here that I didn't uh, I didn't get? Actually, with that open. What I could do is, oh, but that'll drop that one back down, won't it? I was going to say, I could hit that switch again and change this to the bridge. I guess it doesn't matter that much, because now what I'm seeing is that I'll be able to run out, and I could hop up there, jump across here, and get in there. If I could turn the bridge on, then I could just run across and go over, but probably what I'll have to do is just take a big old leap of faith. Really? Why? <laughs> it jumped. spinny things up there. Can I scan it from down here? Yeah. Is that gonna drop? Hmm. I see. And then how... That is, that is the room. Okay, before I do that, I want to look back and see if I can figure, figure out how to get through that door. Also, since this is controlled by that switch, I should just be able to go and change this one. stays up. All right, good. So now I've got the bridge, and I've got this way to jump across. Now I just... I want to see if there's something I've missed that will turn on... That doesn't affect it. That'll turn on that door. I don't see anything. That just controlled this. There's nothing over there. Nothing on this platform. I just want to make sure I'm not missing it, because once we're out of here, that's it. I bet it had to do with that one way back here in the back room that we couldn't do anything with. Controls this one. Is there another console in here that I didn't didn't touch? There's nothing up top. Oh, was there? There was that, but we activated that one. Maybe there's going to be something in here later? That doesn't make any sense, though. We're already practically at the end.
I want to get everything, but I may just have to go on. It's, it's not appear that there's anything around here. And up until now, anytime there's been something to open a door, it's been like within, um, within viewing distance of the door, because it always throws a little light beam. And there aren't any around here, unless there's like one down, down below, hidden from view. No. Maybe it'll open up whenever the, uh, the purification field is going. And so then we'll have to run out, jump over and go in there and then come back, <laughs> get this and then go, man. All right. I think it's, I think it's just time to Pull the lever and go for it. Why? I hate that little false jump that happens sometimes. Open it up. Highlighting interface connections, Pathfinder. So we just have to do all of them so we can activate that one. Is there going to be like a time limit or some kind of puzzle to solve? Or with all the, all the cover, there's probably going to be some baddies that come out. Here they come. Yeah. Is there another one? Yeah, you got him. Oh, what you hiding in here? Come on, get it. Open it up. Hostiles ahead! The music gets lower when I'm inside here. I mean, now the music is done, but there was like a little bit of battle music and then it would get softer when I'd come inside the field. All the sound gets more muffled as well. It's a neat little effect that I just didn't notice before. These remnant don't quit. All of them? Okay. No. No more. Fuck you, buddy. Oh god, I'm taking a lot of damage. Is that the only one? No, there's one over here. This console will activate the purification field. You may want to sweep the area. Before this place tries to kill us, you mean? Mm -hmm. I think that we've gotten everything. I think. 
There wasn't anything else in this room, was there? Shield oscillator. The space water. It's a very cool effect on the water. Yeah, I think we're just gonna do it. And have to hope that I was right about that other door opening. Right. Ah, crack my knuckles. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay, get ready to run. Here it comes. Go, go. Hit the switch. Hit the switch. Hurry, Ryder! No time for remains. Is that door open? No, it's not. Damn it. And I can't do anything with it. No, I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> Wasted time, I'm dead. Doesn't classifications are up? Are these things even any good? It's closing in on us. Move. <laughs> yeah, all right. Try again. So what is it with that door? I want to figure this door out. Let me let me wander around, see if there really is like some tiny thing I missed that I'm just not picking up on. I've been running around and I have no idea how to get this door open. I don't see any kind of console or anything. Like maybe maybe there's something around. Has that always been there? No, that's only there when I scan. Why is that only there when I scan? Oh, God. Oh, there's a big, long... Wait. Ah, get up. Get up. Get up. Shit. What the fuck? Ugh. Uh, <laughs> Fine, fine. Try again. Why? <laughs> Ryder, you're supposed to grab onto it. You're not supposed to just fall into the water. Where, where is this? This console will activate the purification field. You may want to sweep the area. Before yeah. this place tries to kill us, you mean. But... What does this connect to? God damn it, again! really looking for is whatever that is because this this other one Remtech that we can grab it on the way back very much unrelated I will add this map to your interface Pathfinder
up there. Ooh. Oh, I never would have picked that up. Does that yellow lead all the way back here, though? Like, did I just have to come in here? Is that what that was that I actually got? Oh no, it goes somewhere else entirely. I thought maybe it was connected to, like, one of these in here. Maybe that just goes right back to back out to the very front. It was the first one we used to activate all those, like, little red bubbles. jump on <laughs> I was gonna jump that I should not try to jump that that is far this one I could do all right is this gonna be worth it processing core sell it for money it's scrap all that time and effort I noticed that, ah uh, shit, shit, that this one is still up while that door is open. Is it gonna just go back down as soon as I turn on the, pur uh, the purification field? Well, anyway, we're done here. I've had enough of this vault. This console will activate the purification field. Get ready to be purified. I want to sweep the area. Before this place run. tries to kill us, you mean. Okay, get ready to run. Oh, it Here it comes! So go, go! Now we can jump up and across here. Get the thing. Bridge. Thank you, Bridge. Oh, crap. Crap! <laughs> Thought I could jump farther. Oh, god, I'm hitting every button. <laughs> We're good. We made it. Seal it up. We're done here. Man, never gets less terrifying. Let's get out of here. Oof. Yeah, I've had enough of this place. Well, hopefully the water's less spicy now. I think beyond that, it, the place is fairly livable. It's not too hot, not too cold. It's just gross water. Oh, there's some bad boys outside. I hear them grumbling. They're very upset that we changed the water. They like the spice. Yeah, it looks pretty much the same. Ah, shit. <laughs> Reloading! Is the big boy coming? Oh, he is coming. There's hope for Kadar yet. Is the water out here so that we go touch the water and be like, oh, look, it's not that bad now. Man, should I do this? Oh. 
nature is healing. What about that? Oh, now you can go swimming in the beautiful sapphire waters. I'm gonna have to decorpse all these lakes though. It's gonna be nasty swimming in corpse water. Yeah, that that's pretty nice. It's way better than like some of the other solutions we've had where it's just like the planet is <laughs> not as cold but still very cold, for example. What else do we have around here? Satellite, scavenger, hideout, scan some minerals, scanning, and memory triggers. Okay, there's some other stuff around, but it's already an hour and a half that I've been recording, so I'm going to stop here. So we'll go up to the top of that hill and get that next time and then hit some of these other things, probably do some of that, if we can even get across the mountains to go get that, and then back up to do that. Then we can go back into Kadar Port and talk to Reyes and do all that stuff. Oh, we also need to go set up the outpost site because we're like one point away. So maybe one of these things that we'll do, probably bringing down this will bring us up to 75%. Okay, so that's it for tonight. I will see you guys next time. Good night.